Surprise. <laughs> Donnie Lama. Yeah, I just, I just got that. Yeah. Good evening, Mr. Cheadle. How are you, Joe? Very well, thank you. And you? Hello, Lily. We got a whole pot of chickens and a grand piano. Who are drunken and an organ, too. And there's a whole bunch of women playing bingo in the gym. And we can show them all a thing or two. But we ain't got no one for boring. But that's just too much space to consume. No, we ain't got no one for boring. For boring, we ain't got no room. Are you doing all right there, fella? They were thinking vegetables and chickens. Yeah. Happens to me all the time. The all-new Highlander. Toyota. Let's go places! The world of luxury has been pulled over your eyes to blind you from the truth. We just want to get our car. Take the blue key, you go back to the luxury you know. You take the red key, and you'll never look at luxury the same again. I'm Sarah McLaughlin. Will you help these misunderstood animals? You got something on your... right here. <laughs> Oops. I did it again. You doing it, Scarlet. Yeah, you doing it. Change the world one sip at a time. Sorry, Coke and Pepsi. Oh, yeah, she done it. So does Dream. It's a perfect partnership. Um... I think we share a lot of the same core values. Um, you know, their their health initiatives, uh, their environmental initiatives are all, um, you know, are all ones that I'm enthusiastic about. Have you ever noticed how in Hollywood movies all the villains are played by Brits? Maybe we just sound right. Good evening, sir. Thank you, Mary. more focused, more precise, or always one step ahead, with a certain style, an eye for detail, and we're obsessed by power. Absolutely, we filmed this like a cinematic piece. That's why we had the actors we have, that's why we have the director we have. We were creating a film, and we really think that's reflective of the moment that the Super Bowl is. You need to do something that's a little bit different to stand out, and we're not going for a gimmick. We, didn't, we don't have a dog, we don't have a baby, we don't have Carmen Electra, you know, but we do have a fantastic, uh, great cast. We have a great director and this backdrop of modern London that really is where the scene is set as well. So it's absolutely a film, and that isn't just about uh, showing it on the Super Bowl, but that extends online, and the reaction online has been great already. Yes, yeah, a little bit daunting, I can't lie. You know, even obviously it's the second one. Um, you know, the first one was really fun, something that we kind of just just kind of put together and came together. But obviously this time around, um, you know, with obviously Nick doing it, you know, it was something uh, I was really looking forward to working with him. But you know, having it at the Super Bowl, it's no bigger and better than that. So it's, it's like I said, it's kind of daunting because obviously there's so many people watching it. But... Um, I'm excited to see what people think. Um, David Beckham, I guess he's a celebrity. He's a soccer star. I, I like to think of David Beckham as sort of a... The, when advertisers realized just how many women are watching the game and figured, you know what, we got we to gotta give something for the women to look at. It's a beauteous day, a wondrous day, the flowers bloom and the animals play. The 